Hey, what up? Me here. So welcome back to me. Welcome back to me. Yeah, it's your first time in my channel. Welcome to my channel. So a couple of days ago, I said to myself that I must um, start editing already and uploading all my past travels and event vlogs that I filmed. Um, I think the last vlog that I did was... Uh, was... Oh, was 2018. <laughs> it was a Valentine kind of vlog. Um, basically, I did the cover of an event in our church. So if you haven't checked that vlog, I'll put the link on my description box below so that you could check that out. And a lot of things happened in the past two to three years. And with the quarantine we have now, it's just so fitting that we could be more productive with our time, knowing that it's better to stay home so that you'll be more safer than going outside. And so as for me, um, what better way to be more productive is to really do some cleaning up and arranging some files from my hard drive. And so starting with this one, I'm going to bring you in my series of throwback vlogs. So without any further ado, here's my throwback vlog number Potato corner. Oh. Everybody knows this. Everybody knows ah, it's it's an evangelical dance. What if it's not? What if it doesn't look like that? What if it relates to people who are atheists? What if it relates to people who doesn't want the gospel? And if you shock gospel, then we do our mission, right? We do it effectively because there's not just one way to portray a crazy message like that. Yeah. It's a really good message. But you know that when you're on stage in the new friend bowl, I said a friend bowl in a million people, how do you say? You're not gonna ask the 50 million people, how did I do? Hey, put down a friend bowl. Ano, how's that? 
So maybe that's one thing you can do. Think about the only person who matters. And he knows what's in your heart. And be like, okay, ito lang, ito lang yung soul mode. And he's probably gonna smile. That's my son. That's my son. That's standing. That's honest. Pwede hindi natin matanggal yung judgment ng ibang tao. But we have somebody to look to. Who doesn't judge us. Amen. The same people. Yun.
is because of what Jesus has done for us at the cross. I believe that I don't know what you're going through. I don't know what challenges you might be facing. But if you know who your God is, and you focus on Jesus instead of the, prob of the problem, then you'll realize, ah, oh, my God is so much greater. And I always knew the word and I knew of Jesus, but I still got lost and I still got attacked and it took a personal encounter with Jesus to truly know who He is and how good our God is.
To put your art out into the world for fear of rejection, for not being good enough. And I just feel God would say once again, not by might, not by power, but by His Spirit, by His Holy Spirit. but to give out. Why? Because it started with my quiet time with God, with my intimacy with God. I'm dancing before the Lord.
sound of victory. We are your people. We are your army, God. And you are our father. You are our defender. You are our leader. You are our general. You are our king. You are the savior. That worship is a powerful weapon. And I know I just felt so strongly in my heart to pray for the young people, people in my generation, those whether you're in school or you just graduated. The enemy has been really trying. Let your presence set us on fire, God, and you can shoot us from the inside out, God. Touch our hearts, change our lives, God. Let us know you in a deeper way than we could ever know or expect, God. I'm just gonna end it here. Thank you for watching.